Okay, so why is IP consolidation so important in the data center? Um, traditionally, each PDU today requires an IP address. So you're looking at about one to two IP addresses per cabinet in order to plug in all your different PDUs in the data center. Um, through IP consolidation, you can reduce the number of network ports being used for PDUs alone uh, in the neighborhood of 80 to 90 percent. Um, our eConnect PDU product line, you can <coughs> daisy chain up to 20, 20 PDUs under a single IP address. So instead of using 20 IPs, IP addresses, now you're just using one. Um, you can use an additional one for a redundancy network, uh, that's what network factor. But in general, you can, you can save 80 to 90% of not just IP ports, but also the cost that comes with deploying every IP port. So also by daisy chaining or linking multiple eConnect PDUs, you can monitor every single one of them from a single IP address and a single web interface. So you can switch from PDU to PDU within the same screen. Um, some other features become available when you daisy chain the PDUs. You can also group individual outlets, um, in, uh, group individual outlets for multiple PDUs. Uh, you can also copy settings from one PDU to the next. So you spend a good amount of time putting all your alarms and all your thresholds in one PDU. You can take that and copy the settings over to another one. So in general, you get a better visibility of, of your data center when the PDUs are daisy chained. Uh, from a single web interface. Now, if, you're do, if you are monitoring from a, from a separate platform, each PDU is still seen as an, individual, um, as an individual product. So each one is assigned a specific ID, they'll broadcast their PDU names, and that information gets passed on through the network. So either way, if you're managing it all together with the web interface that's built in, or another tool, you have access to every single PDU on the, on the, on the daisy chain.